Tinubu become the 16th president of Nigeria. That is what is trending right now. A lot of people are having a say at this. And then we need to talk about it because yesterday something heroic happened. He removed fuel subsidy and now petrol stations are holding fuel. That is what the news is all about. We still got something coming in from the side of the video who was in Abia today, who was in Abia yesterday and had a lot of fun with the inauguration ceremony of the governor elect of that state alex ot is the happiest right now and a lot of people are really talking about it whiskey has broken the afrobeat record that is what is coming in from whiskey and a person of uh, addition where actually expanded on that or expatiated on that particular you know kind of thing i think we need to listen to that and get a grasp of what is really happening in the afrobeat sector for more news like this you can decide to hit the subscribe button below the bell notification icon to always get notifications each time we upload our videos jay-z booked me paid for my team's flight to us that is coming in from dj spinner a nigerian dj is getting a lot of accolades for that yes we have to understand that afrobeat is gradually you know kind of catching up with the world right now and it's like and it's spreading like virus at a point like this whiskey's oju eleba got people dancing at pd Didi's private pool party. Afrobeat to the world. I keep saying it that the next phase of the world entertainment will be on Afrobeat. I think we are gradually seeing it because a lot of people are keen into it and investing their energy resources into Afrobeat. So talking about Bola Ahmed Tinubu becoming the 16th Nigerian president, a lot of people are really excited about that. While some other persons are dragging pastors who prophesied about the election and about his inauguration i think a lot of people are now saying that we have many fake pastors across nigeria and you don't have to listen to them especially when they start making predictions about much about uh, elections and about a lot of things what is happening right now is at his own inauguration yesterday a person of Bola ahmed Tenubu removed the petroleum subsidy and that has affected nigerians a bit because most petrol stations are now holding fuel that is what what is quite disturbing. Cheung Kuti has come out to provoke Davido, Kunle Afolayo and other individuals shortly after being released from prison. <laughs> that is what the news is all about. Some people are having a say at this. I think I have to read out a particular report on that. According to what he said on his uh, Twitter page, he said half of the people criticizing this government as the worst thing ever. They go collect award for Abuja from the same government. No one will reject it on the principle or oh, Buhari don't legit make Una just tell me I they ask for one presidential candidate like that. Sheon Kuti wrote on his uh, Instagram page and that has been translated in many forms. I think uh, we need to understand it. The lies of David o, the lies of uh, Ayo Mayoko, that is a person of AY, the lies of Afolayo were given awards and that they've collected and these people were vocal against the government and he's asking has the government changed talking about whiskey performing in us at the festival i think uh, we have to listen to addition where according to him he said whiskey did what nobody has done in the history of afrobeat yes whiskey did something that has never been done in afrobeat before he came to afro nation festival stage with his own production he set up a stage worth over 150 000 pounds and gave a world-class performance that is coming in from Adesha. Well, let's take a peep. Yeah. Yesterday, Whiskey did something that's never been done in Afrobeats before. I'm going to say that again. Yesterday, Whiskey did something that's never been done in Afrobeats before. You're going to ask me what it is. Whiskey came to a festival stage with his own production. Let me say that again. Whiskey came to a festival stage with his own production. Let me say that again. Whiskey came to a festival stage with his own stage production. The only people that do that 
are the greatest of the greatest musicians. Chris Brown did it, which means that before that artist steps on stage, they have to rearrange the stage and then bring his own production on, his own screen, his own stage, his own house, his own... They have to build the whole set on a different level. Not just like a, a, a small kind of setup. No, 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 no. We skid set the stage. If you see the videos that I posted and the pictures that I posted, Michael choose. Michael, when am I getting the pictures? Quickly. I'm in the middle of a conversation with my people on Instagram Live. I need to know when the pictures are going to be ready. Te all right, technical issues. We need the pictures so that the people can see the greatness of what I'm talking about. Shout outs, DJ So Good. So, Wizkid had his team management. Shout outs to management. Jada P, Sonia Re, the entire team, they had a production on stage that was crazy. They set up the whole stage. They covered. Listen, me, I don't know production, money, but I can tell you guys categorically. Take it to the. Before I jump off, I want to say thank you guys for watching our videos and thank you for the love so far. If you are new here, you can click the subscribe button below, the bell notification icon to always get notifications each time we upload our videos.